right, guys, we're getting into part three on the billet head, and this one we're going to get into the math, but it's math made easy with the calculators that we've designed for Einstein motors, so let's run through them. All right, so we're on this, this side. We've done the bowls. We've cleaned all that area up. We've got a couple of little areas in here that we'll have to improve in version two, um, but I was just going to show you how to measure it up. Uh, she goes a little there. Yep, not bad. So we're going to write that up on the board and I'll just show you how to calculate the average CSA of a port. That's the shot. So we've basically taken uh, our throat size, our divider size, and we already know our window of our programming. But I'll also show if you struggle with this uh, shape, because uh, even uh, in Einstein's calculator, it only has oval round stadium which is basically two radiuses which i use for the rbs and then just shift it till i get to where i'm um where i know i need to be uh, the window and this is 1675 so um now we'll just plug that data into the calculator and it'll give us our average cross-sectional area across the port all right so we're in the einstein motors app and we're going to go to the gold uh, membership this is where our Twin cam calculators are, and we're going to go to calculator pub, and we're just going to go down to our twin cam CSA calculator, which is here. Um, we'll just stick with stadium, that's probably going to be the easiest. The RB width, um, you can use stadium, it'll get you pretty close. I know what it needs to be roughly, so. Um, that's pretty close to the size. Uh, we'll punch in our divider widths and I'll just rough them out. I'm not going to give exact measurements here because um, obviously this belongs to the guys we've developed it for. Okay, so we've got all the data in. As you can see, the entry is around that 1673, 1675, which is what the um, program is our total divider area is about 1653 so a little bit smaller and our throat area is uh, 1555 and that gives us a total average port CSA of 2.523 square inches or 1627 so we can use this information now obviously we have the um, throat area at that um, basically 1555, 1556. And we can go into our flow limitations. We can put our valve size in, which is around about a one mil over. A 90 mil throat, we'll leave the flow coefficient to high performance. Um, actually, before we calculate, our targets are going to be for this version one about 325 CFM and we can see the 1555.97s bang on target so maximum theoretical flow out of this head is going to be about that 342 CFM and even if we crack the uh, 325 for such a low window that's a basically 95% flow efficiency uh, result which is not too bad if, if we can get that for our first um, basically round one with this port development that'd be great but we also need to see how this is going to perform uh, again there's been a lot of changes so we have to validate uh, all this as we go but um, yeah it's a, it's a good start anyway there's the cat both calculators and that's how you work it out all right, guys, that wraps up part three. That's pretty much it for this series on that billet head. That's now off to Queensland and then overseas. So if you like this sort of stuff, give us a thumbs up. And yeah, hopefully you learned something. Cheers.